NC Outdoor Sport Fishing is brought to you by Yamaha, BC Outdoors Magazine, Rapala, Duncan B. Lodge, Port Boathouse, Low Rats, Mayhem Fly Fishing. Welcome everybody to BC Outdoors Sport Fishing. We got a special uh, special show. We got Mike Hudson back from Port Boathouse. Welcome to the show, Mike. Great to be here. Thank you. Yeah, right we got a new guest, Dan from Eagle Nook. That's right. All right, so let's talk about this beautiful spot we're in. Because <laughs> I got to tell you, like, I, this is my 11th season of filming. Mm -hmm. I filmed in this area before. I had no idea this was here. Yeah, like, how naive am I? We're tucked away. <laughs> yeah, this um, is we like beautiful. it. We like being hidden. Yeah. And uh, you come around the corner there, and you get oh, this yeah. beautiful spot. Yeah. It's amazing. So let's uh, let's talk quickly about uh, where we are in proximity for our guests if they want to come up, and then what you guys offer in way of services, and then we'll talk about what we're going to do later today and tomorrow. Yeah, you bet. Um, we're in Barkley Sound, yeah, bottom of Vernon Bay, okay. uh, Imperial Eagle Channel, about an hour boat ride out of Port Alberni. Yeah. Um, for people coming up in their own boats, they can launch at Kalu Sea Haven right in town. And for our guests who don't have boats and want to go fully guided, you can drive into China Creek, water taxi picks you up. Yeah. And we have fly in with Sierra right out of Vancouver. Oh, awesome. All right, so and fishing is, what's fishing like right now? It's uh, really good. Has yeah, it good? Right? Yes, I'm looking forward to getting out on the water with you guys. Okay, what are we going to be targeting, you think? We're looking for Chinooks. All right. Yeah, I it's August, it's Barkley Sound, the yeah. Chinooks are here. Mike, you like fish for Chinook? I love the Chinooky. <laughs> you like awesome, catching man. Chinook? Yes. That's awesome. Okay. All right. Well, you know, we can sit. I think we're like, guys are just coming in. We're a little bit late. We can go do try the, yes. uh, the afternoon bite. And then tomorrow morning, we've got a full day. Roger that. Right. So why don't we go uh, load up and go take a rip in the boat and see if we can't scratch something up this afternoon. If not, we're full on tomorrow morning. Right on. Well, let's right. on. I'm excited to try out this new motor. Oh, you wait. It's something special. Right on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> It's on. Train it too. There we go. <laughs> What'd you say? This is the hot corner. I call it the hot corner. Yeah, I think it, I think for it exactly is. that reason. Yeah, that's awesome. Here he comes. You gonna go for it? Sure. Oh. We got Mike Hudson on the net here. Oh boy. How are we doing? Oh boy. Let me see if I can knock this off. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> nice start. Right on. Beauty. Beauty. Nice fish. Nice. Good morning start there, there you go. Wake the muscles up. Yeah. Hello, See how hello. cat-like reflexes it was on that rod? You guys even have a chance. <laughs> there we go. There Beautiful Barkley Sound schnook. One for one on the hot corner. Nice. I'll get this in the box. Mikey, jealous? No, not at all. You're up next, buddy. I should have let you go first, but <laughs> I get one in the box. Look at the fish down there, right? It's crazy. Right at the gear. Yeah. I always tend to think that fish took a look at it. Yeah, when they get that little When they have that swim, yeah, yeah, swim to them. Yeah. Salt and rivers in like a long time. Those big slabs. Swam right at it, 43 feet. Nice. Mike, here, Mike. Mike. Oh, is he good? Mike, is this wind worth it there? Yeah. Mikey? It's yeah, just I, a little guy. That's a huge one. <laughs> no. He's not sure. Okay, I won't knock on, your clip on, off think this about time. It. There we go. There we go. It's on the uh, double black glow and the BCOA anchovy teaser head. I think it shows to go how important depth is. Oh, nice oh. job, too. And the depth. Yeah, I gotta, yeah, I mean, I'm running traded, your numbers. Traded depths and it's, <laughs> it's working. Oh, yeah. nice one. Oh, jeez. Oh, yes. oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Don't lose them, Mike. Don't <laughs> lose them. Trying hard not to. Swimming right to the boat there. Oh, he's going to go. <laughs> You're ready. Ooh. Oh, beautiful. <laughs> beautiful. <laughs> He's an angry like... Chinook. We're trained professionals here. We can oh, keep a rod that. down. Look at Look this at guy that. go. Yes. <laughs> he is. That's hilarious. There you go. You got him now. Okay, back. There you go. There you go. There you go. 
Gotta lift his head up. There we go. Woo nice. Good job, Mike. There you go. Hey. Hey. Not bad. One for four one, now. One for two. Oh, two. Oh, that's right. Yeah. And I get the small one. How did that happen? How does that work? That was an acrobatic fish. You know what? Mike would have killed a normal guy, but you yeah. can handle it. Check your leaders. We'll be right back. It's called the Thai Mother. Holy man, look at that. The brass inlays represent the eggs inside her and the eggs she lays. Oh. <laughs> in the first year of our program in 2008, one person released their Thai salmon. This year, 93 and 97. Closed captioning brought to you by the world famous Duncan Be Lodge, located in beautiful Rivers Inlet, BC. Woohoo! Huh? You're up, you're up. Oh my god. I'm going, oh my god. Okay, so watch the tip now. Okay. I'm gonna give it to you. How do you do this? <laughs> That's a screamer. Does this thing. Holy! It's a screamer. We got one. We got one on, Trev. <laughs> it's big. It's a megalodon. It's angry too. It just about knuckle busted me. All right. So you know how to do this, right? Because normally you're coaching. You need coaching. I don't just know. I'll just rod I'll just wing it. Yeah. Okay. That uh, that came off the clip and it sure did. Run. I've been eating my Wheaties or doing my yeah my exercises. Look at them out there. Yes. I have basically the only control I have is just holding on to them. Yeah. I can't really bring them in right now. Oh, there's a little jump. Stay in the water, buddy. It's kind of neat how you got your your collection of guides and they're all working together trying to get everybody fish and That's right. on the phones and you know you just got the phone with your with your guy that was on the other side there and he's giving reports what's there and reports here. It's it's great when the team kind of works together like yeah. that because it, it is really it's all about catching fish. Any thing. successful team, you gotta yeah. work together. The boys are great at it. How long have you guys been doing Eagle Nook for now? We're on 12 years. Wow, okay. Yeah. yeah. And mm. what's your season like up here? When do you guys start? When do you finish? Start late May. Yeah. Uh, go through till first or second week of September. Yeah. That's a pretty good season. That's it's an extended long. season. Yeah. Right? You know, it's good. And you get lots of different runs through here. Yeah. So right now we're on these returning Chinooks to Barkley Sound area. Yeah. But earlier you get runs that go by in June and then it's just constant. Yeah. Constant different runs coming through. This right. is exciting. Now I get it. Yeah. <laughs> I see what all the fun's you're, about. You're gonna hang up your guide days and you're yeah. gonna become an angler now. I'm retired. Yeah. <clears throat> or you just guide and take the rods out of your guest hands. Whoa, oh, Jesus. Yes. <laughs> oh boy, oh boy. Jesus. You didn't like the look of me hey, more than that. What the whoa. <laughs> Ah! <laughs> wow. And there's another reason why we clear the gear. Yeah, exactly. That guy would have been gonzo. All right, one second here. Let me here. turn them. Woohoo! Awesome. I think he's in the net, boys. Nice job, buddy. <laughs> that is gorgeous. Nice. He got Beauty. bigger. I yeah. thought he wasn't that big. Yeah. That was a great fight. <clears throat> Love right. it. So where'd you get that on again? Uh, your gear. That's right. Yeah. 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 Which your, is your numbers. My numbers, yeah. your gear. It's good. It's working. It's working. Work. Really good. We're just goofing around here. Oh, we're doing a TV show, catching fish. <laughs> Laughing. Forgetting yeah. to check our gear. <laughs> yeah, that's right.
Drop your anchor. We'll be right back. No one knows the West Coast like Port Boathouse and the boat you need to enjoy some of the world's most spectacular waters. Whether you want the performance and comfort of a cutwater boat, a ranger tug, the superb build quality of a North River boat, or to relax on a sun catcher pontoon, we have it all. We're Yamaha's largest outboard dealer too and deliver on the kind of deals and service that leave everyone else behind. Port Boathouse, celebrating 40 years of service. Yamaha, Yamaha revs your heart. For a big man, ah. getting to that rod. Hey, did you guys see that? <laughs> Holy early morning Chinook bite. Like the sun's not even over the mountains there yet. Angry. Oh, oh there's jumper. that jump again. An angry king. <laughs> I had him at the boat here, and he just like had it. Slowly swam up and had a look and was, no, I'm, I don't like that look. Look at that boat. He doesn't. Or that guy on the end of the rod. He doesn't think you're as good looking as we do. No. <laughs> Can you see him? It's so it's dark. Can't see him. Hey, there we go. Right. We got him. Hot streak. You know what? I'm gonna let this guy go. What do you think? He's sure. a good candidate for a definitely a release. He's hooks not, her out not quick. Bleeding hooks her out. Beautiful. Want to slow it down a bit, Mike? Beautiful. Yes. There he goes. That doesn't get old. Good job. I man. love releasing those fish. Good job. Yeah. All right, well. Mike, you're up. I'm having my fun now. Oh, that's, that's right. Pretty cruelest words in fishing. Mike's yeah. up. Mike, you're up. <laughs> And now, here's a look at today's tackle and gear. Hey folks, we're gonna talk to you about the gear that we've been using on today's episode. Uh, we'll start with rods and reels. Uh, rods of choice, the brand new Legacy Series. Uh, mooching rods, these are 10 and a half foot, um, medium action. Good job so far, right? Nice, nice did a great bites. job. Yeah, great job. Uh, the reels again are the Legacy Series Lure Jensen. And we put the uh, I like putting 25 pound high vis test. It's all, it's all I ever run. Yeah. And then I'll line up again for the for the leader material, right? So yeah. uh, that's kind of the basic setup again. Uh, legacy rods, Legacy reels, and then the Suffolk uh, high vis line for me here, right? You know what? After today, yeah. Um, haven't run those. Never touched them before. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Great stuff, setup. Right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, leader material, 30 pound Suffix, uh, fluorocarbon. I love fluorocarbon. Guys are running a 30 or 40 pound fluorocarbon. Yep. Again, I just line up and uh, this just allows for visibility, tensile strength. You're not uh, busting off too many fish with these, right. these guys, right? Yeah, it's good. Even if there's a knot in it, sometimes you get that yeah. inadvertent knot. I yeah. found them and it, that's, that stuff works great. Yeah, that's awesome. So flashers and stuff, I mean, every, every place we go, there's all different colors and we're looking at your stuff and there's, you guys like running a really kind of mirrored flash so going through my stuff i don't really have a ton of mirrored stuff so the uh the blue uh the white with the blue this is the the stuff i use off and down the coast this is as close as i get in it worked today yeah caught some fish on that today too uh the old standby though this is the one that uh, produced pretty good today i gotta say again the double black glow is that one surprised me but it worked yeah it's yeah. pretty good isn't it right yeah. so uh there you go folks there's the double double black glow flasher that i've been preaching for the last few years and make sure you go and get one if you can find them right uh, teaser heads again, so we ran some different teaser heads. These are the, the setups that I ran, and then you ran a couple setups too, and we'll talk about that in our Learn with the Pros, but that wire, that yeah. wire setup was really cool too. But again, we just ran today, so 
uh, this morning when it, the light condition was a little low, I ran the glow, and we actually had some really good success on the glow yep. teaser heads. And then later in the afternoon, I tried to go with the uh, the chrome, and we didn't get any bites on this one today, but the, the glow performed. And I actually today. like that one better for our style of, or our area of yeah. fishing in August, but yeah. you know what? Hey, yeah, funny throw, it's not always what, the, what you think the fish will That's like. Right. It's what yeah. the fish like. So. Exactly, right? And then you guys all, of course, uh, Procured uh, chartreuse green anchovies on my side of the boat. It's, I, I roll them. Used it today, before. Right? It works. And you know the stuff, yeah, right? I, I've, really I've well used too. it. Yeah, it's good. And then of course, brand new North River. A uh, brand new, but it's a nice North River. 2016 North River. It's in pristine shape, of course. And then and you then got the 25 <laughs> Yamaha right? monster. Yeah, <laughs> it's some fun with it today. We got some cool video of that thing revving up and going right. Huh. And. Uh, Lawrence Sounders again, key, right? We had, to, we had to watch that, watch that bottom and look for the bait. Balls hey, we saw that. Sound. We saw that one fish on there. It looked like it was chasing bait, yeah. and we got a hit. So yeah, that's pretty cool. There. Yeah. Yeah. And Scotty High Performance Downriggers, of course, again gets you up and down real quick. And then brand new to the season two are the shark cannonballs. And we saw some fish coming up, and we were thinking, okay, they're either checking the cannonballs out, yeah. or they're checking the bait. And sometimes <laughs> we weren't getting the bite, so maybe they're checking the cannonballs out, right? So that's yeah, all good. All right, folks, we're gonna follow up a quick list, and then we'll see you out on the water. Drop your anchor. We'll be right back. To me, it's about priorities. I'm never gonna look back and wish I had spent more time in the office. So I look for chances to disconnect, to reconnect with what's important, to remember what life's really all about. So make a splash. You never know where it could take you. Yamaha, conquer water. Oh, who's up? Who's up? Who's up? <laughs> oh, oh, what did I say about the rocks? So that was a one-handed power grip. See that? I had pistachios in one hand. He hasn't decided what he wants to do yet. Keep in mind that side's at 47, just in case we get okay. shallowed up here. Okay, now he's mad. There we go. <laughs> Should I clear this one? Yeah. Okay. I think we should. I, he. Yeah, let's just be careful of it all. I love this little uh, spot on these boats, Mike. Yeah. This Kinda is a nice great there. advantage point for playing a fish. I think it's the fish is making its mind up. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, Simba. Wow. I think the bite's on here today, boys. Something. Hey, <laughs> this guy is some kind of unhappy. <laughs> so just so I don't know if you're out of practice, just watch the rod tip. The rod tip will dictate everything that fish wants to do. Actually, you should be able to do this blindfolded. <laughs> yeah. Just feel yeah, the feel rod. Feel the force of a just fish. Just feel it. You don't have to look at yeah. it. You just got to feel it. Hey, Dan, just to let you know you're on an island by yourself. No pressure. <laughs> don't mess this up. <laughs> Mike, I was made for pressure. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, it's his oh, third yeah. run. He's gonna be tired here. Oh. Oh. Just about got me. Oh, that was close. Just about got me. You took your eye off the rod tip there, I think, young grasshopper. Oh. <laughs> okay, I did not plan on playing a fish for 20 minutes here today. <laughs> not in shape for this. Look at that. I just guide into him. <laughs> Do I need to chase him? Turn the boat around. Yeah. I think we switched up on that one. We got that one on the purple chrome teaser head now. That's two fish on that one. Went away from the BCO special, which is really, you, really hard to do. Really hard. So I'll be confiscating all your gear when we get back <laughs> yeah. to the dock, yeah. all right? Yeah. Just okay. so that you know. All right. <laughs> Fair enough. Actually, we had lots of good stuff working today. Yeah, it's been good. 
Okay, Mike, you're up. Can you That's see it, Mike? There he is. There Ooh, he yeah, is. he's beautiful fish. Oh. The purple on him. All right, Mike. He should be good to go. Hey! Yes. <laughs> Victory! Howdy, you did it. <laughs> Look at you. Look at me go. Not just a pretty face, Huddy. That got a little bigger. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Look at you. That's a fat fish. Hey. Nice job, rookie. <laughs> Thank you for that. Yeah. I need to That's have awesome. you guys up more often because That's awesome. I get to play fish. Yeah. There's a replacement fish for your buddy. Yeah. Nice. Right on. Good stuff. Good stuff, boys. For a special Learning with the Pros featuring Dan Brunette from Eagle Nook Resort, check us out online. On the cliff. Oh, fucker. Who's on this one, Mike? That's you or Mike, whoever. Mike. No. No. Yeah, how do you up? <laughs> Try to clear this rod here. Okay, oh, yeah, he's a little better. <laughs> he's way, oh, I'm hooked. Oh, oh, no. Now I don't want to be here. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. oh, sneaky little bugger. I just, I pulled away just there. So just his head turned back down. <laughs> hey, I didn't lose it first. Here we go, we got another one, another one. Oh boy. Jesus. Almost a double header, boys. I think we could technically count that as a double header. Coming right there. Thank you. Oh no, did I lose him? No, oh, he's coming up. Here he comes. He's got the net. Beauty! In the back of the net! <laughs> Top shelf! Good job, way to go. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, double header on the turn, well, technically. We got one in and then the we'll other call side it a double-ish header. We were trying to maneuver out of the way yeah. of boats and hit another fish. Is yeah. Textbook, that's how we do it here. You know the best part is, is we had a we had a crowd, we had an audience. Yeah. It's a COVID crowd because we're all <laughs> spread out at least six feet apart, but that's as close to pro sports as we're going to get right now. That's right. <laughs> here we go, what do you think? Not a bad. Not a bad morning nice here. morning. We just came out for early morning fish here just to kind of get our last day in and uh, made a move. Had a, a nice release on the far side, came over here. Heard some reports of fish and yeah. I think we're kind of rock stars here. So we bumped into this, <laughs> we that's four fish. We dropped in <laughs> on- four fish right away. <laughs> we dropped in on two fish yeah. and I feel sorry for everyone yeah. else, but yeah. well, not really. <laughs> yeah, I got you. Yeah, this has been, uh, been an awesome trip. Right on. Your facilities are unreal. I, like I said, I'm blown away, I had no idea. And I'm so appreciative of you guys having us up here. And Love Mike, lots of fun. Yeah. Sorry about all the ribbing, but you know, you, you kind of deserve it. Goes with the territory. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, yeah that's great. Love what having a, what you guys. A, what, a, what a way to end the trip. Yeah, love right. having you guys. It's been yeah. a blast. We got a ferry to catch. Oh. <laughs> yeah. But thank you folks for joining us on BC Outdoor Sport Fishing. We look forward to having you join us on a future episode.